Hi everybody, I'm Tim Tamashiro and uh, I'm packing to go on the Canada C3 expedition. This is very, very exciting. I can't wait. We depart tomorrow from Edmonton. But you might be wondering to yourself, what is it that you pack for a trip on an icebreaker? They sent a list. Here we go. Next we pack. Okay, first off, you gotta bring your passport because uh, uh, well, it's very, very north, and you, you know you need identification, obviously. A little bit of cash. I have a little bit of cash in my pocket as well. I got a warm uh, little merino wool jacket that will be a nice little base layer uh, for staying warm. This pack has all the clothes that I'll be wearing. All the clothes. Oh, I got a bathing suit, long underwear, socks, wool socks, lots of wool socks. I have all of my shirts and I got an extra warm shirt, I got t-shirts, I got underwear, you know, all those kind of necessities. Then to stay warm. This is the uh, this is the situation. I have a nice pair of uh, very warm gloves that I have uh, made a big investment in. These are expensive, but they'll last forever. This is a uh, this is a musher's hat that I got. <laughs> in the Yukon, actually, in Whitehorse. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna take that, keep the old ears warm. Got a belt, my sunglasses. This is a, well, it's kinda like a ski pole. Oh, yeah. It's also a monopod, so I can use the camera on the monopod. So that'll come in really, really handy, and it collapses down to nothing. Got a, a nice hat, like a cap. These are rain pants to put over top of my jeans, which I'll be wearing on the plane, by the way. Uh, these are shoes that I'm going to be wearing for uh, the inside of the ship. That's the, the icebreaker shoes. Uh, I've got a pair of hiking boots that I've just uh, resprayed and going to make sure that they're nice and waterproof, which they are. This is a big one, though. This is a set of rubber boots. And apparently we'll be going in and out of uh, Zodiac on, on a very regular basis. So we have been asked to make sure that we have rubber boots. How they're going to fit in there, I don't know. If they don't fit in there, no big deal. I'll figure out a way. Okay, so rubber boots. And I might add, I got these ones that are lined because they're going to be nice and warm. This is a treat that I'm going to be sharing with uh, new friends that we meet up north. I'll tell you more about that in another video. This is a warm coat. Uh, this is a like, a like a micro fleece or whatever. A raincoat, which is a waterproof layer, and it'll keep the wind off of us when we're out in the uh, water. And interestingly enough, what you don't see here is a like a warm winter jacket. That's because the nice folks at Canada C3 have been kind enough to let us know that there are warm down coats on board that, so we don't have to pack our big bulky ones. Isn't that something? That's awesome. This is like uh, all my medications and toiletries. This is my day pack. This is a secret. You'll have to find out what that's all about in another video. And then these bags are just extra waterproof bags that uh, will uh, come along with me just in case I need them. So that is the basics right there. That's what you pack on a trip to an icebreaker.